There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, what's up, what's up? Like I'm doing all this hand movement like I got on some fingernails and stuff. You know how you get nails, you get your nails done and you feel really cute, like, you know, sophisticated, fancy, like, you know, extra. And you do all the hand movement. Like, I think like this has actually stayed with me after I've even removed the nails. Like, so I'm gonna be the first to admit, or maybe not even the first to admit, but I was doing the nail thing. They were long and I did talk a lot with my hands. I feel like now is the time that, well, maybe not now, because I have a granddaughter that's a newborn that I have to kind of like adjust to. But in a couple of months, a girl want to get her nails done again because I'm doing all of this with none of this, okay? But what's up, you guys? I hope you're having like an amazing day. I'm not really sure when this is going to go up. But honey, happy Valentine's Day. Even if it's late, every day is Valentine's Day. You can always love on yourself every single day, okay? But I hope you guys are having like a really great day. I feel like today is a good day for me. Um, I did get some sleep, so I'm, I'm, I'm happy about that. Like, girl, listen, you know, I am raising a newborn baby, okay, my granddaughter, Tinky sister, and um, it is very challenging, especially when you have finished those stages almost 15 years ago. So it's, it's challenging, and even though I have helped raise Tinky, that was like seven years ago. It was seven years ago. So it's still challenging. And things have changed. You know, things change. Tools change. Clothes change. Baby gear change. A lot of things change. And it was more, it, I wasn't so hands-on then because my daughter was more involved. So this time around, it's like more of a 85% April, okay? Doing well with it. Um, and I've been getting a lot of tips and advice. So I thank you all for that because, girl, listen, I, I'm not sure if you all seen my live but um i did mention that i got the car seat stuck on the shopping cart and i was about to just leave the damn thing and say you know what i'm gonna just get a new one because i'm not about to sit here and fight with this but i did manage to get it off a lot has changed in this world so i am what is it called orange is the new black grandmas are the new moms okay grandmas are the new moms that's what it's that's what it's about i guess you know things are going um pretty decent um i wish nothing but the best for my family and my daughter and i just hope and pray that you know life will be a nothing but a blossoming flower for her. It's best. That's the best way I can put it. But yes, you guys, I'm here and I'm back. I haven't recorded a video in like three effing weeks, okay? And a girl is running on, hello, tequila, not tequila, but margarita with some tequila and some Red Bull up in this. Yes, honey, we're about to get it popping. I haven't had a drink in like a while, so I felt like I needed this, especially because I'm free. I'm free of babies today. And with that being said, thank you, Wusa, to that. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm about to be 48 this June. Round me off, I'm almost 50. A lot of people will say, you lying. Some people would be like, oh, you old. You know, the young generation. You old, you old, you old. But I'm going to just say this. For those who are underneath me, like in their 20s, girl, you wig. But today's wig video is being sponsored by RPG Hair. RPG Hair. Okay? Period. Um, They did send me one of their 20-inch silky straight lace fronts 13 by 6 lace fronts and it is 20 inches 180 percent invisible hd lace clean hairline girl this reminds me so much of like a crystal lace wig but i won't really know until i put it on but the hairline is amazing on this and i like the fact that they really have spruced up their website now the one thing that got me like okay so i'm gonna just be honest this i didn't wash it i did not bleach it i didn't do anything i was so shocked when i took it out the box it was like bleached already girl okay you can always tell when you have good lace because the lace is always kind of like frayed at the bottom. That's how you know it's like that really good HD lace. That's just my way of being able to tell. I didn't wash it and I didn't need to because it was already done for me. So I was like, you know what, girl, I'm going to just, I'm going a, I'm to a hot, hot comb it, flat iron it and see how it comes out. But I have, I'm going to be using, oh damn, I'm going to have to buy some more of this. One of my favorite new hairsprays, which Daily Glueless Lace Spray by Janet Collection. Girl, I'm telling you when this, this is like some good hairspray for your wigs. Like dry super quick and it just has a, like an amazing hold. 
you do have the option of getting a mousse too, which you know me, I love the Dollar Tree mousse by um, Salon Selectors. I love the Salon Selectors mousse that I have been purchasing from the Dollar Tree for years. But this, like, you know me, I don't let anything come in the way between me and that mousse. But honey, this right here, this right here, this right here, girl, is like everything in a mousse, like amazing. And then they also do have like a product that you can apply prior to this to apply to your wig to, you know, allow it to hold a lot stronger. And um, I left that in the bathroom, but we don't always need it. But this stuff is like amazeballs. Like this is like the best hairspray on, on the market. And I know a lot of you guys love the uh, Got To Be. I'm not like a huge fan of all Got To Be's, but that right there by Janet Collection Girl. Let's take a sip to that. We're going to get into this video. We're going to go ahead. Okay, you guys, let's check out RPG Hair. This is the unit that I received from him, which is their amazing one wig, three different looks, HD lace, 13 by six lace front. You can do it in kinky straight, curly, or it also can be worn in silky straight with just a little heat. This is the kinky straight look without any type of hot comb or flat iron to it. And this is the silky straight look with some type of heat. Now if you spray some water, then you're definitely going to have it curly or you can wash it. The inside of the cap construction is 13 by six, which is a deep parting. Hundred percent human hair. You can get it in the invisible HD lace, clean hairline, deep parting, variety of lengths and densities as well. And it also comes in small and medium. Check out our PG hair down below. I'll make sure to link it for you guys. All right, you guys, so I already went ahead and put some of the wax stick on the hairline of the unit be careful because the hot comb is super hot as you guys seen i almost scorched myself and i'm just going to lay this hair line flat and flush to my own natural hairline now as i stated the hair is three different looks in one you can wear it in its natural state which is more or less a light kinky straight kind of look to me or you can hot comb it or flat iron it and make it silky straight or girl, you can co-wash it or add some water to it with some conditioner in it in a spritz bottle and curl this baby up. So you have three different looks in one, which is very affordable. Instead of buying three different wigs, you have it all here in one unit. I like the fact that the hairline is super clean, which makes time savings. Okay, girl, meaning you don't have to sit down and pre-pluck the hairline. Now this is something that I like to do to my units because I do like them to lay as flat as possible and fit comfortably. So I will part them over the ear tab because it is extending over my natural ear. And I'll make a part and I'll take my thread snip scissors and I will cut directly above the ear. This way the unit fits right above my ears. It lays flat to my head. It's comfortable and I have no issues with it moving around. And I'll just repeat that on the opposite side. Now you don't have to do this to every single unit, but for those units that do extend past right above your ears, I would suggest this. This is just my suggestions. You don't have to do this if you don't feel comfortable. And now I'll just take these thread snips and cut away at the hairline, or not cut away at the hairline, but remove the lace. These are thread snips. I prefer using these over scissors. And I'm gonna also be using this here, which is the Isha by Janet Collection 
primer. This is going to prime my hairline so that it is nice and clean and clear. And also, this will also protect my own natural skin from any type of glues or hairsprays. This will also allow the unit to sit a lot better or adhere a lot better. I'm also going to be using the Daily Glueless Lace Spray by Janet Collection, which I absolutely love. And this is the Absolute Isha brand. And I'm just going to spray one layer prior. Now you do need to make sure that the primer that I sprayed first is nice and dry. And once that's dry, it takes about a minute or two, you wanna spray it on your hairspray, one layer, allow it to get tacky, and then go back in with a second layer and allow that to get tacky. Then you can go ahead and lay your lace down. Now with this spray, I really don't need a blow dryer depending on the actual lace. I have noticed the thicker the lace, you will definitely need a blow dryer. But because this lace is nice and thin, it's the HD lace, I don't need a blow dryer. It adheres flawlessly, effortlessly, without any type of heat to dry it. And I'm telling you girls, this hairspray, it's become my favorite. Now do you see that hairline nice and thinned out for you? I'm going to take my comb and I'm going to make me some um, sideburns and just one little swoop of a baby hair right there. This you don't have to do, but I did notice that I should have bleached the unit because it is bleached for you, but I like it to be bleached, bleached, bleached. So if that is your preference, then by all means, you can go ahead and do so. But I didn't. I just wanted to get the wig on and try it out. Now the Styling Mousse by Janet Collection, which is the Isha Absolute Edge Tamer Styling Mousse, girl. This is a game changer. I love it. Y'all know how much I love the mousse from the Dollar Tree. Well, uh, this is the replacement of it. I still will use the mousse from the Dollar Tree, but I'm really loving and digging this mousse. Plus, the scent of it smells so good. I'm really, really loving the smell of this mousse. Plus, it sculpts the baby hair so nicely and just allows it to just, you know, fall into place. Now, being that I've already went ahead and lay down my edges I have my water bottle here and it does have some conditioner in it the conditioner I put in here is just a few spurts of it and it's from the Dollar Tree nothing expensive but when you are wetting your hair make sure that you have conditioner in your water bottle so your hair does not dry out but do you see those curls girl nice and juicy curled up super duper easy I'm feeling that and now on this side, I'm gonna go ahead and flat iron it. And we wanna see how sleek this gets because like I said, you can go from kinky straight to silky straight or you can go from curly. And I like to use both my blow drying brush along with my flat iron. So I just wanna kinda like straighten it a little bit with my blow drying brush because I wanna see how it'll look just with the blow drying brush alone. It wasn't too bad, but I decided I'd just rather go ahead in back with the uh, flat iron and just really sleek it out. But if you don't want it sleek, sleek, then by all means, you can just use a blow dryer or you can let it air dry. But me, I'm just going to do a couple passes of this hot comb, excuse me, this flat iron. And I want to just get it super, super sleek and see what the look is. Okay, look, this hair is effing cute. Listen, either way, the hair is bomb.com. I love the hairline of this unit. It flows so nice. I'm so glad that I didn't have to pluck it or do any of that stuff to it because girl, I get tired of doing it. Like that is so time consuming and so much work. Um, But the fact that it curls up so easily on the opposite side was like a plus to me because like I was saying, like normally when I try to get like the juiciest, juiciest curls, you definitely have to co-wash. You have to wash it again. For it to just be spritzed down, like I did give it a nice spritzing, the curls came out really, really juicy and good. They're not stringy and straggly like so I think they're very decent. So if you definitely were out and about and you went from straight to curly with this unit, you definitely would be able to. But here's the trick. You would need some conditioner in the water. Don't think you're going to spritz on water. I mean, I'm pretty sure it would work like that too, but it's really important to make sure that you have some type of conditioner in your water so that way the hair stays moisturized. But yes, hunty. So what's my favorite? side like I like them both uh, mm -hmm. 
I don't know. It just depends on my mood. It just depends on my mood. But I will say RPG hair done did the damn thing. The lace is amazing. It's very like see-through HD. I love the hairline that they have created. So that way you don't have to spend your time working on it, which is great. It did come pre-bleached. You, you may need to put a little bit of bleach in it. I didn't do so, but you can. And I think that if you do, it will work out amazing for you guys. Hair is really cute. I think it's dope, dopey dope. Like soap on a rope. Hello. The, these curls are juicy. I, I'm liking these curls. Like I really want to spray the other side down, but I'm not gonna do that because girl, I'm about to do curly wig anyway. So check out RPG hair. I will leave all the information down below. And you guys already know this Janet Collection hairspray is definitely to go. Oh child, look how strong this is. The hold on this is amazing. Like I have two more wig videos to do after this and this wig is stuck. So I'm just going to hopefully spritz it off with some of this remover and get it off. But yes, girl, if you want some really good holds for the day or days, you can definitely check out Janet Collection. You want to try their primer, which I hold even longer. And all I used was the hairspray, but girl, definitely really strong. And there was no blow drying process involved, okay? So I love you all. I'll leave all the information down below. And you guys already know on that note, I got to go check out RPG hair. And let me know what you think about this. Cutie but tootie. Ooh, ooh, ooh. -wee.